He was the most decorated soldier of the greatest generation. We're talking about North Texas native Audie Murphy. He was honored with 33 international awards for his service in World War II. And it all happened before his 21st birthday. CBS 11's Bud Gillette reports today, though, the state of Texas did not award its highest military honor to Audie Murphy until this afternoon. My grandpa used to, like, hunt rabbits and just hang out with Audie Murphy. It was a day everyone either knew stories about Audie Murphy or wanted their children to learn his story. My great-grandfather was in World War II on both sides of my family, so I want them to see the importance of it. It is the wartime service of Audie Murphy. Born in Hunt County and enlisted illegally at age 18, he nonetheless fought in Europe during World War II and in one famous encounter single-handedly held off six German tanks and 250 troops from a burned-out tank destroyer. He won the Congressional Medal of Honor. Texas had previously bestowed its highest military honor on 10 other servicemen, but it wasn't until today that it brought it to Audie Murphy's only living sister. Governor Rick Perry called him an extraordinary human being. The courage that he mustered, the reflection of the Texas values. Nadine Murphy Loki accepted it with what was typical Murphy humility. And I've always heard it said that you're not really dead until you're forgotten. So we don't want this to happen to our people that lost their lives, giving us our freedom. Farmersville decided a long time ago it was not going to forget Audie Murphy. It hosts Audie Murphy Days here every June. Audie Murphy came home to be a movie star and horse breeder, but reportedly never shook off the effects of the war. He died in a small passenger plane crash in 1971. But his sister told me his story should be an inspiration to young people. But I think they need to pick out something they want to be and stick with it and go with it. Bud Gillette, CBS 11 News.